Patrick Asselone, Chuck Zito. Here is the fight we've been waiting for. Rosie Sexton versus Gina Carano. Rosie Sexton, 5'4", 135 pounds, 29 years old, 6 and oh, she is undefeated as a pro. She is a belt holder. She's facing Gina Carano, five foot eight, 139 pounds. Of course, Sexton giving away that four pounds there. She's doing it, and she's okay with that. Let's meet the fighters now. Rosie Sexton from Manchester in the UK. I did my degree, my maths degree at Cambridge University, and then I ended up in Manchester doing a PhD. And. Um, it was around the time when I was doing that, that's when I started getting involved in this sport. Um, I found out about mixed martial arts and uh, decided it looked like fun. And uh, that's when I started training. I think I've got a good wrestling game. I've got a good ground game. Um, and really, I don't think I do anything particularly different from anyone else. I just good, solid fundamentals done right. My name's Gina Carano, and I'm from Las Vegas, Nevada. I specialize in Muay Thai, and I think that's like the most hardcore um, uh, stand-up uh, style fighting that there is out there. And maybe that I'm biased or whatever, but I just think it just rocks. So, <laughs> um, But I know that the girl that I'm fighting, Rosie Sexton, she's, um, she's, she specializes in um, grappling and submissions. So I'm just going to want to keep it on my feet. I'm just beginning to grow, and I haven't even really like touched on who I am. I, I'm just like opening up a door right now. And I'm just like kind of like just opening. I, I haven't even opened it really. I've just got my hand on the knob. And I'm really excited to see what I'm capable of. And I'm really excited to fight this girl because of who she is. She's uh, one of the top girls in the UK. And you know, I've always wanted to fight somebody, you know, great, you know, to see what, you know, they bring out in me. And, you know, I know that she's got a lot more experience than me, and that's perfect because I want to be pushed, you know, and no matter what, like, I want to see what I have in me and then grow from there. Guys, I am not waiting another millisecond for this fight. Steve DeAngelis introduced the women. Fight number five, sponsored by the Olympic Gardens. Red corner, Rosie Sexton. That's Dr. Rosie Sexton to you, Steve DeAngelis. Six and oh, as a pro, 29 years old. She fights out of straight blast gym. As Gina Carano was saying, this is an extremely good fighter. Very, very technical, very disciplined. She's freestyle on the ground, boxing as a stand-up discipline she feels great she gave away the four pounds without even thinking twice she's very confident in her abilities as well she should be and if there's anybody who can figure out her odds of winning it's got to be her phd in mathematics from cambridge university she's one of those smart Blue girls corner. my Gina mom always told me to stay away from the Colorado. All righty, as you can tell, the crowd loves Gina Carano. She's been in a bunch of reality shows. She was in the indie film Ring Girls. She was on a reality TV show called Fight Girls on Oxygen Cable Network. She brings a lot of people with her whenever she fights, especially in her hometown of Las Vegas. She's 1-0 as a pro. Her Muay Thai career sported a 12-1-1 record. Again, she looks significantly bigger, not only in poundage, but just all around. She does look a lot bigger than Rosie Sexton. Oh, yeah. She is a lot bigger. It's just not four pounds. She sweat down and yeah. still was four pounds over. Rosie agreed to fight anyway. She came to fight. She's not going to back down from anybody. I'd say Gina's probably a good 10 pounds heavier. Yeah, yeah. At least. Gina Carano At is least. not. She's got a few inches she on She is her. not a bantamweight. There's no question about it. She is definitely not a bantamweight. This featured fight is in the women's featherweight division. Your referee, John Schorl. Introducing first the fighter in the red corner. Standing in at 5 feet 4 inches tall. She weighed in at 135 pounds. She is undefeated in the cage with six wins to her credit. She is the Cage Warriors women's champion. Fighting out of the straight blast gym all the way from Manchester, England. Rosie Sexton. And 
and her opponent, the fighter in the blue corner, standing in at 5 feet 8 inches tall, she weighed in at 139 pounds. She is 1-0 in the cage, but she has a Muay Thai record of 12 wins, one loss, one draw from Las Vegas, Nevada, Gina Conviction Carano. Guys, I have goosebumps. Gina Conviction Carano versus Dr. Rosie Sexton. This is going to be a quality fight in the bantamweight women's division. This really is. We are looking at two of the future ladies of mixed martial arts. Gina's got that look in her eyes. She's ready. Ready? They're both ready to go. Here we go, round one. Sexton in the red trunks, Carano in the plaid. Look at the difference in size. Oh, oh big nice. Kick. Oh, oh, oh that. beautiful kick. Yeah, felt that. Felt that. Look at the boxing skills of Carano. The left jab, keeping the distance. Sexton going for the shoot. Oh, sick knees. I don't she know if Sexton has ever faced this kind of Muay Thai before. But she better get she better get Carano off her feet. Gina is just way oh, yeah. too strong. She's too strong. Too big and too strong. Wow, Carano, Carano is looking just invincible in there. Oh. oh. Sexton better get let those hands go. Sexton better let those hands go. She is in major trouble. The way, the way Rosie is standing, Gina is not intimidated at all. She will walk right in on her whenever she feels like it. And great takedown defense by Gina Carano. Well, she is so technical and so disciplined. Well, Rosie's not trying to set up that takedown with anything. She's just, nah, she's taking, just taking a shot. She wind up running to a knee. Yeah, she's taking a beating. Look at that left thigh. You can see the imprint of Carano's foot on Sexton's left thigh. That's a shin, Jay. <laughs> is that a shin? That's a shin. It's the size of a foot. That is a big, strong shin. I'll tell you that right now. Big knee by Gina Carano. And so far, Rosie Sexton has been able to mount zero offense. At least she's keeping Carano in tight. She, that's what she has to do. What, what does Sexton have to do to turn the tide of this fight? She needs, she needs a lock up a little bit higher on Gina. Try a trip, take her down. Do not let Gina get any distance on her whatsoever. If she steps back to throw some knees, it's going to be it's gonna be bad news. Sexton finally mounting a little bit of pressure here on Carano. No major threat, but she at least has stopped the beating. So in this picture, you can see that's definitely not a foot. That's a yeah, shin right. bone. That's a shin bone. <laughs> that is not meat hitting meat. That is bone hitting meat. Interesting. Interesting. That's She's got to go. Farewell for Rosie Sexton. No, Rosie's going to get right back in there. Oh. 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 Looks like Sexton has, has really got to get her hands going, doesn't she? She's, she's got not to, using her hands at all. Yeah, she's got to make Carano think. Oh, wow. What a great move. Gina's got that choke in oh, deep. Oh, uh oh. She's got the choke. And she's got incredible leverage. She's much taller than Rosie. But Rosie's coming out of it. I think she is, she's out of it. She's out. Look at that. Rosie's a fighter. She is a fighter. Three minutes and 20 seconds ticked away Rosie here in round listening one. Listening to her corner, driving Gina into the cage. Okay, look at that. She's kept, she's kept her cool. And she has Carano in a situation. 